too. So we'll keep the verbal out for a while, all right? Make sure you're in zone four. Nice. Rub, rub two eyes. Awesome, Jessica. That's perfect. Okay, keep your string in your hand there, sweetie. Cause see, see how useless it is with that strings on the ground. Now you can tap them. Tap them on the brand. Come on, come on. Don't cluck. There you go. Come on, you're doing good. Great. Now rub two eyes with the stick, cause that's the, that's kind of your tool. It might. Okay. All right. So let me give you a demo here on how this can change. Watch this, Jessica, because this is going to mean something to you guys. You just seen your sister, how she's kind of a little bit. Now see how this horse is asleep. See the body language that I'm going to create here versus the verbal. All right, watch. Lead, lift, swing, touch. Okay. Yeah. Do you guys want respect, or do you guys just want? Watch. If you go there a few times, watch the difference. But I gotta get back here and see how I'm here and rubbing. If, I, if I'm where she is most of the time, because see, here's the thing. In horsemanship, when you get these colts, you guys know if you got colts at home or not, you need to be on a good angle to be able to control it. If you're on a bad angle, is about when I'm like I can really torque them here right lead lift swing touch all right and rub now look at the difference here I went to phase four a few times but I went through the phases all right touch okay cock a leg whistle hang out cock a knee there you go there you're hanging out now good all right get your hand on your shanks right girls there you go. All right, start your game. Good. There you go. Drop your string now, Cassidy, and whap them on the brand. There you go. Hang in there. Good. There you go. Now you got two eyes, right? Rub him with that stick and string, fling it up over on his back. You know, kind of descent. 